Charlie, it's all over. It's all over. Look. Look, it's all over. Yeah. We're free. It's gone. We're free. Sure. What, what, what happened? Carolyn, I, I... I had to turn it on Nicholas Blair. He's dead. Carolyn, I had to do it. He was gonna kill me. I had to do it. He, he was trying to hypnotize me. So I, I, I took, I took the, the thing out of my pocket. I put the shadow. I placed it on his heart. Then he screamed. And I ran out. I didn't even see the shadow. But, but honey, it's over now. It's over. Oh. I think of all the, all the trouble I put you through and all I wanted to do was give you happiness. I will now, Carolyn. Now I will. We're here, Jack. We must leave here. We must. Run away. No, no, no. We'll just go to a place and... Any place. Just, just so we're away, away from all Jeb, this. Jeb, Jeb, where would that be? I don't know. Just any place. Will just we find a place? Will we? Will there be someone there who hates you as much as Nicholas Blair? Oh, no. No. How can you be sure? Jim, why did he hate you so? Look, Carolyn, that's, that's all gone now. That's all in the past. I mean, there's not even a, no point in discussing it. But, Carolyn, let's just, let's just leave. Get out of here tonight. Jim, we ran away once before. Yeah, but the shadow was on us now. But this time it's different. Wherever we go, it's going to be different. We can forget everything that's happened here. Yes. Yes, we can. We must. Wherever we go, we will be different, Carolyn. I promise you that. Let's go. Go pack your clothes. We can't. We can't go tonight. It must be my mother. Well, tell her now. We'll leave. We'll leave tomorrow morning. Oh, Carolyn. Carolyn, nothing can happen now. Nothing. Now go tell her. You will never leave here, Jeb. Never. The dead will not let you. Why are you in here alone? I thought my father was in here with you. Oh, no. No, he isn't. Where are you going? I'm going to the uh, carriage house. Why? I'm going to pick up some camera equipment there. Why don't you wait and get it in the morning? I don't know. Because I'm leaving with Caroline. We're going on a trip tonight. Jeb said we were going away tonight. Oh, David, you must have heard wrong. Carolyn, how come every time I tell you something, you, you think I get it mixed up? He said tonight. But I wonder why he changed his mind. Why didn't he say something to me about it? I wish you wouldn't go away, Carolyn. I'm going to miss you. You're not going to stay away forever, are you? No. Not forever. This will always be home to me. All I know is that when I grow up, I'm leaving. I'm going where the action is. Oh. Action! Now, I know where the action should be. In your bedroom. Come along, David. It's late. Do I have to go to bed now? Carolyn's going away. Uh, everything is all right, Uncle Roger. Is it? What was the matter? Whatever it is, it's over now, David. Come along, young man. I'll take you upstairs. If you want to chat later, Carolyn, I'll be in my room. Now, come on. No nonsense. See you again. Oh, David. I'll bet you that tomorrow morning I'm still here.
Free of him as I am. You can go back, back to your old life. No, no. Don't try anything, Sky. Don't try. just been to the cottage. I examined Sabrina. She is very weak, Barnabas. I'm sorry, Julia. Oh, Barnabas, why? Why did you do it? Now, Quentin told me that you'd given him your word that you wouldn't go to her again. But I gave him my word. I stayed at the old house and fought the urge to, to leave. And then she came to me. And you couldn't help yourself. Do you think I do this by choice? Barnabas, I, I am aware of that. I know what you're going through. And I know the injections are responsible. Don't blame yourself, Julia. It's the thing that's, that's just happened. Until the effects wear off, Barnabas, you're, you're in danger of, of exposure. People in the town are being worried about the attacks now. And you're afraid that I will... Kill Sabrina before 
Well, before the effects wear off. Well, I'm quite aware of that. Oh, Barnabas, there, there must be something we can do, some way of, of controlling your need for blood. Julia, for the past hour, I've been thinking of that room in the East Wing. What does that have to do with it? Julia, if I could only transcend that time warp that exists in that other room, if I could only get to that other world of time. Do you think going back to that other world, that other level of charm, would, would change things? I don't know. But it might be a way of saving Sabrina's life. And it's possible, Julia, just possible that... that I... I might be... Well, not the same as I am here, but quite normal and be able to live in the daylight. I was trying to transcend that other time level can be very dangerous. You could get trapped there forever. And who is to say that might not be a blessing? Barnabas, Barnabas, once we did find a way of having you live in the daylight, we could find a way again, Barnabas. Barnabas... You belong in this time with us. Perhaps I do. But I can't help but be fascinated by that room and everything I've seen there. 